Now that the 8th season of Game of Thrones has finally started, we can see Sophie Turner again playing Sansa Stark. And although this character has brought her international popularity, it is not the only role that the actress is known for in the world of cinema and series. Stay with us and we will tell you what other projects she has played in. Do you know that she was struggling with severe depression and that a new role which can change her life and her career in a lot of ways awaits her? Stay with Curious Hips to find out everything about Sophie Turner. Born on February 21st in 1996 in Northampton, Sophie Turner is the daughter of a teacher and employee of a pallet factory. At the age of 11, the girl started studying at King's High School where the drama teacher persuaded her to take the part in casting for the first season of Game of Thrones. Sophie won the role of Sansa Stark, although the competition was really big and even one of her main rivals was a girl with acting experience. Later in the interview, Turner admitted that social media was behind her success in the casting. The actress said her competitors Editor were more talented, but she had more publicity on social media, which granted her the role. And with that, not only her career took off, but it also gained momentum. Sophie made her debut as Sansa Stark in 2011 when she was only 14 years old. She also admitted that other members of the cast think that she looks very much like her character, and the actor explains it by saying, Well, I've been told by other cast members that I'm a lot like her. Maybe when I first joined the show, I was only 13 and grew up with my character and acquired some of her traits. What's more, at the audition, Turner also met her film sister and the girls liked each other from the very first place. Today, Sophie and Macy Williams are devoted friends outside of the series and we can often see them together on Instagram. Interestingly, for the first seven parts, for the role, Sophie has been dyeing her hair red, explaining that thanks to this, in her private life, it is a lot easier to avoid fans and journalists. In the last season, however, she decided to use wigs. The actress also announces that this will happen to her character. I can assure you that you will see Sansa in armor wielding a sword and ready for action. The production of Game of Thrones has really affected Turner's life. In their interview for The Telegraph, Sophie admitted that on the set there was a teacher with her who in the intervals in between recording taught her to the GCSE exams and thanks to him, she passed all the exams including the drama exam. The actress matured along with the development of production and today is ready for new adventures and new proposals. In 2012, Sophie was nominated for the Best Young Actress Award. She also managed to get to the film. Her first role on cinema series was the main role in Another Me. In 2016, she played the role of Jean Grey in the film X-Men Apocalypse, which was critically received by critics and earned over $534 million worldwide. Sophie, still in the role of Jean Grey, will be the main dark character this time, Dark Phoenix. Sophie Turner has also been involved in other various projects such as music videos. One of them was a clip for the song of her fiancé's band, The Jonas Brothers. Sophie also recorded two audiobooks and she also directed and produced an independent film called Heavy in March of 2018, which was screened at the Independent Film Festival in Cannes. She was also a model for Wella Hare and Karen Miller, and one of her hidden talents is beatboxing. On the set of Game of Thrones, she used to split beats to Jack Gleason's rhymes. On Turner's Instagram, we can see that she supports many charities and is socially active. Sophie, in March of 2017, announced that she became the patron of Women for the Women organization supporting women who survived the war. However, she has recently been preparing for the role of a wife. The actress in 2017 started her relationship with Joe Jonas, with whom she met in 2016 on Instagram. The couple often express their love on social media for one another. Their wedding is to be held in France this year, and Macy Williams herself is supposed to be the maid of honor. However, Sophie not only wants to become a wife but also hopes to take a break from acting because she has to take care of her mental health. Recently, during an interview with Dr. Phil, she revealed that she did not want to leave the bed because she did not feel well with her appearance and bad choices in her life. She also mentioned that she even thought about taking her own life. Now I feel much better since I have time for therapy. We can see this change on her social media because the actress spends more time with her fiancé and family. Will being the wife of a well-known musician change Sophie's approach to the film world? Do you think that Sophie's career will end with Game of Thrones? Let us know what you think in the comments and remember to become part of our Curious Hips family by subscribing to our channel. See you next time!